Hey, hello everybody, this is Chill and today I'm bringing you Farming Simulator 2015. Yeah. It's the uh, release day of this, and I'm sure all you fuckers are wondering how do I install the dedicated server so I can dedicate and have all this shit going on and, you know, all this other stuff. But anyway, alright, so this is how you do it, guys. You gotta buy a different copy of the game for a dedicated server, and you gotta have a dedicated server box for that to happen. Yeah! Alright, so go ahead and get your uh, dedicated uh, server box, and then you get a new version of Steam. You just get a different account uh, for Steam if you want to do it that way, or you can buy it off of Amazon and download it that way, and then you don't have to have Steam to run it, or whatever the hell, okay? But you're wasting your damn time if you put a dedicated server on the same computer that you're about to play the game on. You're wasting your damn time, okay? Because it's not going to make a difference. You should just run a P2P if that be the case. Everybody understands that? Okay, we're good. All right. Next thing that we have to do is uh, we have to go to our, uh, after we download it, we've got to go to our Steam Apps folder, which is uh, your program files. If you're on 64-bit uh, Windows, you go to 86, you go to Steam, you go to Steam Apps, you go to Common, you go to Farming Simulator 2015, yeah! All right, anyway, uh, and then you double-click on your dedicated server here, guys. Just like that. There you go. Uh, what you're going to want to do after that is you're going to want to have to go down here to... Uh, let's see here. I'm sorry. All right. Dedicated server H XML. You open it up with notepad. And you can see that there's the password right chair. Okay. Then we're going to go to our uh, Google Chrome here. And we're actually going to type in our IP address, or whatever that brought up there. So that's 192.168.32.5080. So you go to 192.168.32.50. And the port. Oh, shit. Hold on. And then you go to the port. 8080. All right, what that's going to do is bring up the interface for your uh, actual thing here. So you go admin. And then you come in here and you take this password. And you go Wuku. Okay, whoops. Okay, there we go. Wuku ka chew. And you uh, just uh, ca uh, pop, put that password in there into the password. And there you go. You're in the interface here. Uh, and I don't need that password. But anyway, you uh, change your name of the game there. Uh, see, Chill Billy is. I have it with tits. With that that's perfect uh you can change your administrator password that's when you're in the game you join in the game you type in this password so we're just going to do uh yeah faps there we go all right and uh let's see you get game password there uh you can it's either no password or password doesn't matter uh, it, it says it's not activated but it actually is and it is running and it is working so don't worry about that right now uh, you need to have kind of like a save game to work off of, but it'll do it automatically once you start it. Uh, and then you, it, it, you just go down here and you hit start. And then of course, uh, since it's on international, you'll go multiplayer, join the game. And then there it is. It'll be right there. You just double click on it, join the game and you're good to go. Uh, so that's pretty much how to start a server guys. Uh, I, I will note, I, I will note this. If you close out of this bugger right here, your server's not going to work, okay? So you, if you want to uh, have that, plus all this information is able to change and everything else, you can change it here, uh, and you can also change it there. So it's up to you, okay? But that's to, that password and that login is to log into your admin panel. Um, so anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions or comments, or if you're completely fucking confused, I will explain this to you in person uh, via my TeamSpeak server, which I have linked in the description below. You can also get with Prolassus, uh, which is a, a good friend of mine, and he knows what the hell he's doing when it comes to that shit as well. So you guys just uh, you just bear with me, okay? So we're going to get you taken care of. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Yeah.